zoomed out as far as we can be. Just scoot y'all back. What's up, y'all? It's your girl Red back again. Another video. Okay. Um, so today, or in this video, I am going to be um I'm so excited. Um, my little sister. Okay, wait. So for okay, first of all, I gotta get back into this. Let's start over. What's up, y'all? It's your girl Red back at it again with another video. Go ahead. Don't forget to. I need to figure out like an intro. Cause like I want y'all to like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. But I'm trying to figure out how to like say that without sounding like other YouTubers. So before you even finish watching this video, go ahead and like this video. I can see you. Go ahead and leave a comment. Um Tell me what color shoes you are wearing today. And if you are not wearing any shoes right now, tell me what color socks you are wearing. And if you don't got no socks on, tell me what color your nail polish is. And if you ain't got no nail polish on your toes, put a red heart. That's how I know you real, okay? Okay, so, <laughs> um, let me turn on my computer, cause I'm a mess. Okay, so in this video, I'm going to be showing y'all my whole process of painting something for my little sister. So if you don't know me, um, my name is Kira, but most of the world calls me Red two d's don't forget the second d um i am technically the only child um and i have two best friends that live here with me um in tulsa um i have my one sister that if you have been following me for a while you know her her name is sierra um and then we have we have a little sister her name is d um i also met her in college we're also part of the same engineering and architecture fraternity um and if like you're really, if you know about like sororities and fraternities and stuff like that, you know, you have like a line number and like, you know, you have, you know, maybe sorors or line brothers or bros, whatever, right? Um, you also have like clubs. So like you have like a line number. My line number was three the year I did it. And then the following year, she was also a three. So she is my club. She is my Neo, um, my Neo fight whatever so her birthday is at the end of january it's the 28th let me make sure <laughs> she may watch this and be like girl you don't know my birthday but i i feel i'm I, I know it like her birthday is literally in three weeks oh my gosh her birthday's on the 28th it's in three weeks it's on a saturday um and she um i don't know what we're doing yet her husband she's married ah! her husband um i think is planning her something but like me and sierra need to like call him um but whatever so neither here or there right so i decided that and i decided this a few months ago um i wanted to paint her something so you're probably like ready you be painting girl yes and no um i really love art i really love being a creative i love all things just creatively right and at the end of last year i decided that i wanted to get into painting a lot more like i used to go to like painting sips and paint with a twist and pinos pals like all those type of things and i realized that i can do those things at home if i just bought the materials for them so i um invested in like some canvases and like some paint here and there and like brushes and all this other type of stuff right so I'm like, I just want to get really good at painting so I never have to buy art again. Like me and my my husband, my boyfriend, um, all of the, the art that's going to be in our house is going to be stuff that I created. Literally, I don't want to buy art ever again. Um, so again, with that being said, I decided that I wanted to paint her something. So her favorite animal is giraffes. Um, like she loves, loves <gasps> giraffes. So I had bought this really long canvas. Um, I had just bought it cause it was like on sale, but, um, I decided like, okay, I'm gonna paint her giraffe on there. Like, you know, cause it has a long neck and da da da. And then she loves plants. Like she has a green thumb. That's also her favorite color. She has a green thumb. Um, so I got her a planner and with like the the thing at the bottom the water thing whatever so i got her that so i plan on painting both of those i'm, go I'm gonna paint her a giraffe on the canvas and then i'm gonna paint the planters as a giraffe um 
So if I haven't already shown y'all what the canvas and the potter planner looks like, I'm gonna insert that clip right now. And if I've already done that, then let's um, go ahead and get started. This is mainly honestly gonna be, most of this video is gonna be a montage of me um, painting. It's not gonna really be like a, this is not a tutorial, this is none of that. This is just me showing, doing one of my crafts and just showing that with the world. Um, again, this is my world <laughs> and I'm letting y'all into my world a little bit. Um, this isn't a, a business channel anymore. This isn't a teaching channel. This is just strictly red world. So, and this is a part of my world now, um, becoming and being better as a painter. And I hope that I can look back at like this first video of the year to just see like how much better I get like at the end of the year. Like, I don't know. So I'm just showing y'all what I want to show y'all. So um this is not going to be a one day process at all um but i'm just going to show y'all until we actually give it to her so this is going to be like i said a montage of different time lapses and just like other stuff and whatever um and yeah so let's get to it so i don't really have an art room <laughs> designated art room right now so i honestly just paint in my living room den area i'll use my coffee table and i'll literally put a tablecloth down i think i got the tablecloth from the dollar store dollar 25 tree i'll put that over and it's big enough to where it'll go over my rug or like my carpet and stuff um so i put that on my table and i paint everything on my table literally so i got all of my supplies from michael's the craft store um i already had some crafting paint um that i got in like a value pack but then i also had like some real um painters paint if you want to say like is way more expensive than the crafting paint and i just decided to mix both of the whites that i had with like a tad bit of water that's what i had in that cup so i can paint the the planter um and give it like a nice base because i knew i was going to be painting like the super bright yellow color and then also going to be painting like that brown on it as well so i just wanted to give it like a nice like base like you know when like you're like i don't know if you guys like paint a lot or like you've seen like professional painters like paint like a house or a room or something like they have like a primer so i bet i'm basically using the white paint as a primer basically and i know i said this wasn't a tutorial <laughs> a tutorial or anything but i'm just explaining what i did um so this is the brown and the yellow that I use. They were not clear on the camera at all. So I'll just go ahead and put the specific colors in the description box, just in case you guys want to know the specific brown and yellow that I did use. And when I was choosing the brown and the yellow, I honestly was looking up so many different pictures of giraffes, like on Google. And like, I was looking at like caricature type of giraffes and like cartoon giraffes and stuff to make sure I got the perfect yellow and the perfect brown. And I'm just so happy with how these colors ended up coming out. Um, and it was great. So the white uh, dried really, really fast. Um, actually all the paint dried pretty fast. Like acrylic dries like super duper fast. So that wasn't a problem for me. Um, because this is like, this wasn't technically a fast project I wanted to do, but at the same time, like with me wanting to have like multiple layers on there, I knew that I couldn't do one layer and then like later on that day do like another layer like I wanted to sit for like a day or two to, just so I could see like the real colors and stuff especially before I set it and all that so I'm just very happy that I did the way I did so um I literally did everything freehand like I drew all of the spots freehand um I drew um I did like the yellow and stuff obviously like freehand like from the spots but I did the spots first on the planters um and you'll actually see later i think i did it on the canvas too i can't remember but yeah so literally this is just a time lapse of me just like painting everything uh when i paint it's honestly just a mental release for me 
Um, it's been a lot going on in my life for like the past six months and painting has really been one of those like outlets for me to just like kind of slow down and appreciate what's going on in my life and, um, or to not even think about what's going on in my life just to genuinely just slow down, like for real. So when I decided that I wanted to do this for my sister um, at the end of last year, it was literally a no brainer. And I knew that it was going to take me a while. So that's why I really wanted to dedicate the time to do this because I wanted to truly enjoy the process, enjoy, you know, not just painting something for her for her day, but getting into one of the crafts that I know that I want to be better in this year. And the reason why I decided to record this is because I just want to see how disciplined and how consistent I can be with something I truly want to do. Like I told y'all at the beginning of this video, I want to be able to be so good at painting that I will never have to buy um, art for my future house like ever like when I mentioned it to my boyfriend he knows how much I love painting when I mentioned it to him like yeah bro like I really just want to get so good and just like get better and whatever he was like yeah like we'll never have to buy art <laughs> like you know we never have to spend money on those type of things like you can literally just be the artist of the house um and I took that and I honestly ran with it like I think it is just so important for us black people to truly love the creativity that God gives us no matter what it is um I think everybody's creative in their own way um I'm not just a business owner I'm not just a product formulator I'm not just a painter I'm not just like a DIY hairstylist like I'm just a creator like God created me to be a creator um to love colors and to love all these things um and I'm just appreciative of that so painting is just one of the things I plan on doing this year I can't wait to show y'all and tell y'all the other things that I plan on doing I gotta get some more supplies <laughs> for the other things <gasps> excuse me I am yawning this is really a real voiceover um but yeah so um all right, so I will stop talking because I think I'm, I'm talking right done here. for the day. I did not even touch the canvas. Um, yeah, I didn't even touch the canvas because um, that's not really like priority that I need to start. But I definitely had to start the planters because of um, the sealant. I got to put on it. It takes like a few weeks. So like I should have started it like ideally would have i should have started this right before christmas but like i had a vacation and stuff so i didn't so hopefully it'll still be fine right so let me show y'all what let me show y'all what it looks like so far so this is the planter and like the little water pot thing that i said um i didn't really do um i didn't do like a second coat of the brown on the inside because it is just going to be on the inside um, but I definitely did on the outside and I did the top and bottom of the water thing. Um, of course, there's going to be like some touch ups like, you know, see like right there and like other places. Um, but ideally, it should be dry enough. It's going to look like that. O-M-G. I can't freaking wait. I can't wait till it's all done so let me pick that back up <laughs> um but that is the um update right now what time is it I need to charge my phone it's 1 15 I am about to start getting ready to go to work um and yeah, I think I'm really done for the day. This is all I really want to do for today. So I'm going to clean my brushes. Because last time I painted, I did not clean my brushes properly. So I'm going to clean my brushes so they don't get ruined. Because I just bought some new brushes. Um, everything that I'm using so far, I've gotten from Michael's. Um, Michael's Craft Store. So for whatever reason, if y'all want to know who the stuff that I'm using, like I guess maybe I'll put the links in the description box or whatever. Like I don't know um and yeah that is really it so um we're just gonna go ahead and skip to the next day of me painting whatever that is whatever that looks like um and yeah all right y'all so this is literally like a few days later maybe even 
almost a week later this is the weekend that my grandparents uh decided to come and visit me um and while they were just chilling watching tv i was like well i can just go inside my office um and paint in my office so like i told y'all before i normally paint on my kitchen table but since they were in there and like um i couldn't do that so i actually have this file cabinet um in my office and i just went ahead and put my my little painting tablecloth on it and i just got to work so i think i was watching a netflix show or something i really love to watch uh tv and i love to watch um like tv shows while i'm doing something so that's most likely what's going on so i was in here for like a few hours i decided to paint the giraffe and i'm very happy about how it came out so here's just like a super long montage of me painting the giraffe enjoy the montage enjoy the painting enjoy the piece enjoy the music and yeah Outside in the AMG, right outside.
Yeah. I believe that all of your dreams are duration You took my heart, all my keys, and my patience You took my heart, all my sleep, for decoration You mistaken my love, I brought for you for foundation All that I wanted from you was to give me Something that I never had Something that you never seen Something that you never been mm-hmm. But I wake up and then nothing's wrong Just get ready for work, 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 work you see me do me da 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 So me by that word, 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 word Da 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 When you walk out, da 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 Before the table turn, 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 turn Beg you something, please Baby, don't you leave Don't leave me stuck here in the streets uh-huh. If I got another chance to I will never, no, never neglect you I mean, who am I to hold your best against you? Friends are finding peace. Honestly. 
anybody, baby, if you want me, can't be turning up with everybody, nah, can't be fucking on this anybody, yeah, I got feelings for you, that's the thing about it, yeah, you know that it's something when I sing about it, yeah, mama used to be on disability, but gave me this ability, and now she walking with her head high and her back straight, I don't think you feeling me, I'm out here being everything they said I wouldn't be, it couldn't be, I don't know what happened to them guys that said they would be, I said see you at the top and they misunderstood me, I hold no resentment in my heart, that's that maturity, and we don't keep it on us anymore, it's with security, I'm set everything and it's sat for about two weeks i'm gonna show y'all everything so this is the final um canvas for her like the finish on it is amazing um i use the satin mod podge and it like came out so nice um then i used the purple jar on the planters that was recommended for anything that's gonna be like outside or um it's gonna have like a lot of water and stuff excuse me trying to do these uh thumbnail pictures <laughs> girl i was really trying to pose but um i put the mod podge on it and it said it takes like four weeks to cure um but i definitely just had it doing it for two weeks i'm not even gonna lie um so yeah lastly she's decided to not lastly but she decided she wants to start collecting bookmarks she told her husband she wants to start collecting bookmarks and stuff this year so i went and got some stickers and some cardstock and me and my sister made her some bookmarks so of course i had to make her a giraffe one and then i also made her like a happy birthday one i thought it was super cute super you know like whatever um and yeah and then i'm gonna also show y'all the gifts that my boyfriend got her since he is out of town um he got her this uh plant thing i don't know if it's i can't remember what it's for i'm not even gonna lie to you but he picked it out all by himself and i'm so proud of him she knew what it was so that's all that matters and then he also got her like this brass bookmark it has a feather on it and a giraffe on it as well um we love her so much we we know she had a great birthday and yeah so thank y'all so much for tuning in and i will see y'all in the next video who knows what i'll be painting next but yeah i love y'all and i'll see y'all later bye oh wait i forgot i love you god loves you more <laughs> and then i'll see y'all the next one peace y'all